This is no ordinary Beyond the Dark video. This is typical demonic behavior, man. Hunting. No! no. Yo! Yeah, they can't come in here because it's a church. It's just creeping in the corners here, bro. It can't come. What is that? Something came out. Dude, oh, this is getting actually man, too once again. bad. What? Oh my fucking god. I don't even want to do this anymore. Yo, like, no bullshit. This is not fucking a joke right now. You're clearly not a good spirit, so I'm gonna stay the fuck away from Colin. The boys are now setting up. Colin, what gear are you bringing for this? Oh, we got a lot of gear, man, packed in a very small bag. We got REM pods, we've got static cameras, we've got spirit boxes. I think we've got, what, four spirit boxes? Four. Between all of us. Wow. Um, we got a music box, we got SLS, we got literally almost every tool you can have. The Spirit Talker app, we got your device from England. Oh, yep, the Alice box. I'm ready for that one. Yep. This is no ordinary Beyond the Dark video. Guys, this is the Blair Witch Woods. That's it. Blair Witch. For the first time on Beyond the Dark, Colin from Paranormal Files has actually brought a Dibbit box. Now, we've never used one. I always said I never wanted to try one or use one, but we do have one. But we're gonna call it the Witch's Box either way. And yeah. Where'd you get this guy? Okay, so, actually, weirdly enough, I just moved into my apartment in Philadelphia and my wife and I were getting ready for these two to come spend the night and we were unpacking stuff and I came across this. This is, I mean, Jeez. regardless of what you believe in, it's definitely a creepy box on the outside. It's never been opened. This supposedly contains a ghost or like the eBay posting said a demon. Now, whether or not I Whoa. believe that that's true. Right, we I don't know. know. But I figured with these guys, Yeah. Why not try it, man? Why not bring it out to the forest and see if, I mean, we're going to a church, so. Yeah. What is that symbol? Um, is that like the, the... I think this is the Star of David. I was gonna yeah. Say, yeah. Which like is, you know, they use that a lot in uh, demon Rip. conjuring and stuff. Back yeah, in the day. yeah. Also, Dang. sorry, I'm sweaty as seen. Oh, dude, footage. <laughs> it's summertime. It's hot. It's hot it's, out here. Yeah, it's It's literally hot. hot boy summer. Who's that guy? That's not, that's not like one of those devil worshippers, right? I don't know. All right, well, I guess he's leaving. I mean, to be honest, we are the only ones parked right here to go into the woods. So that is kind of creepy, though. I hope our car doesn't get broken into. All right, this should work. What do you say? I don't know. Good luck. Good luck. Oh, I think he said good luck. Did he say good luck? Yeah, I might even have it on camera. You definitely do. So for the first time, we're hanging out with Colin from Paranormal Files. Hey. You guys everybody. already know Seth Borden. We're all here. We're taking over. Um, we've been wanting to go to Blair Witch Forest for so long. You guys have been asking us in the comments, go to Blair Witch Forest, blah, blah, blah. We're finally here. Now, the thing about Blair Witch Forest, if you haven't seen the movie, I would even stop this thing, go watch the movie, and then come back and actually watch our video on Blair Witch Forest. Yeah. Now, the thing about it is this forest, like, the history of the movie is not real. Uh, so, but the director, thanks to Colin, I can't believe you even got the interview with the I know, director. it's crazy, isn't it? So it cool. Is. I it interviewed is. the director of the Blair Witch Project back in 2019, but we're finally releasing that footage now. Well, the thing is, is that he said as he directed the movie that like everyone thought like this place was haunted while he's filming the movie. And the so what of this video and why we're here is because we want to see if the same experiences that they had filming Blair Witch will happen to us here. A lot of the places in that movie have been completely gone and demolished, but we're going to still try to hit up some of those same sites. And also, one site that's not in the movie we're doing is an abandoned church with a graveyard. And 
I don't know. So, also, I want to add, there have been a number of murders here. Bodies found in this park. Really? Yeah. In this one? Oh, What's this yeah. park called? This is Patapsco Valley State Park, right outside of Baltimore. So, Baltimore. I don't know. If there's The whole yeah. place where we're going is an old town with church, you know, bodies in the ground. Then you have the murders. Then you have, like indigenous traditions and ceremonies and all these different right. things that happen over the years so mm. this place is charged with something right some kind of energy yeah. right they did also say a lot of people uh that were in like rituals or like cults would come here so i don't know if that will do anything or thing but again like i said we have a witch box a divot box we're going to be using and we're just going to wing this guys so let's go and also subscribe to these two guys Let's do it. So I just want to make this clear. If it wasn't for the director footage that we got from the interview with Colin, I don't know where we would go and where this video would go. It makes this video crazy because we don't know what we're going to encounter in this forest. Anything can happen. Blair Witch, if you have not seen it, is such an iconic old school film that kind of created found footage. Stuff that we're kind of doing as we speak. And it's one of my favorite horror movies today. So I'm really excited to be here. It's going to be good. I just want to say before we even start this, thanks so much for all the support. Beyond the Dark is way bigger than we thought it ever would, uh, and we're taking it up a notch. We took a big break from Beyond the Dark, and one of the reasons why is because I generally felt like the ghosts were taking up so much energy, and it was putting me into a very negative spot where I felt burnt out as well, and I felt like I was not able to continue, which is why we stopped it for a while to continue other stuff that we love to do on this channel. From now, from August, all the way until the end of October, as of now, we are doing a lot of crazy Beyond the Dark episodes, which I'm not gonna fully say what we're doing or where we're going, but we're doing it. What was it like to actually, I've always wondered, produce the movie, like what was the actual production process like of filming? Did it, was it ever creepy actually being out there? Yes, absolutely. Uh, I mean, you know, we basically shot it over like eight or nine days, um, you know, continuous days in the woods. And we, we were shooting like 24 hours a day. Like the actors were in the woods mostly by themselves. And then we would kind of intercept them in certain at certain times during the day and give them, you know, food, give them rations and, and then give them instructions for like the rest of the, you know, for the, until we can beat them again. You know, wake up in the morning or, you know, we, first of all, somebody was always sleeping out there at night with the actors, like not in the same area, but we always had like a base camp. So it was just a lot of camping, a lot of woods, a lot of just walking alone through the woods at night. Yeah, so there was a lot of times where, you know, it was creepy out there, man. and, and uh, Especially at the house, like the house at the end of the movie, I did not like being in that house alone. Like I remember one time, it was I'm not sure if we were shooting yet or we were just we were start about to start to shoot, and and I got I was sidetracked in the cellar, you know, where the movie ends, and mm -hmm. all of a sudden I look around, there's nobody around. I'm like, oh, and it's night, the night's coming, you know, it was like uh, right at dusk, you know, like the the you know the sun had already come gone gone down, and this terror like oh my god i'm alone in this house mm -hmm. and I, like just i mean as quickly as possible just moved out and you know everybody was gone i just felt like such a dumbass like you know just being scared like that but that house you know i mean it had a lot of history um you know when we found it it was um you know obviously people had lived there and you know who the hell knows what kind of stuff was uh lurking around there you know uh did anybody when you're filming ever have any paranormal experiences on set in the forest maybe in the house any cast or crew or yourself um, no i mean i don't think that anybody at least um cold uh, like there's no i mean we like gen genuinely like freaked ourselves out just by being in the woods because of the, the the nature of what we were doing and like the you know kind of the dark nature of the of the story you know the this kind of movie that we were making um it, it's almost like it, we 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 were kind of blessed by uh, you know not really having any kind of at least that i know of i don't think anybody had any kind of weird strange uh uh sightings or, or kind of feelings like that in the story as well um what was the inspiration for the stick figures? Also another question I've always had. Please. Holy shit. Come up here quick! I need to use the C4! 
CP! Yo, there's all sorts of shit up here, man. <laughs> the stick figures were, I mean, you know, I'm not sure. I think it was, we always had this idea of like these, these wooden totems or, you know, basically like, you know, how do you make scary stuff? with things you find in the woods, you know? There was some kind of thing where like, okay, we're gonna have hanging sticks, you know, and, and we made some diagrams, but it was just kind of inspired by mostly like a Native American lore, you know? And for us, it was like, we wanted it to be, you know, we didn't, we, there's no like definitive like idea as to what they are, what they are, but it's almost like a, a war, it, you know, it's a warning to people. We always loved leaving the, the logic of it you know, to somebody else, you know what I mean? Because, I, you know, because that's how, that's what we love about all this kind of stuff. And I think you do too, is that there is no definitive answer. Uh, but I have felt, you know, you go into a house and you feel a certain thing. We were doing some marketing stuff and we had like um, uh, this uh, medium come in, this talented, you know, this uh, gifted woman come in. She said that, you know, she went up all the rooms and she went upstairs and then went back down. She said, there's some, there's a, uh, there's somebody up in that attic, and they're really angry. They're not, they're not like you know malevolent, but they're really angry that you didn't ask permission to come in here and, you know, and be in their house. And you know, so it was, you know, and we never, we had, we hadn't told her anything about anything. I mean, I, we had never even talked to her. So you know, I mean, I don't know what the hell you know was going on, but it to me, it's like okay, there's definitely something that my body and the other people's bodies were picking up, and and maybe the lights, the lights blowing out was maybe just us not paying attention, or or you know something, you know, it, or maybe the energy had something to do and did something with the electricity or whatever. But you know, to me, it's like. That was, and it was just not, it was not just me, man. It was everybody. And, and there was some got people that didn't want to do, they would like, I, I, I gotta get out of here. I go, you know, they, they would just go downstairs and, you know, and it was kind of like, and I, I wanted to leave. Like to me, it was like, there was something there that was affecting everybody in the room. You know? Where did the story of Blair Witch originate in your mind? Like, is there a real story that you kind of, you know, took elements from to create that story? I mean, I, th I think we took elements from a lot of different things that, you know, because Dan, Dan Myrick and I, uh, you know, came up with the original idea. And then a bunch of other people came in and to, to help uh, flesh out the mythology of like, you know, the Blair Witch and, you know, all the, you know, kind of the, the, the facts, like the history of the, of the, you know, of the myth. But, uh, but no, we, so Dan and I kind of took a lot of different things from a lot of different um, things that, that kind of like creeped us out as kids. But really, I think the biggest thing would be probably, you know, just this, just the kind of the Salem witch trials, you know, the idea of like, um, you know, a, a woman who was unjustly basically murdered because of witchcraft, you know, this ridiculous thing. Um, but something, Hmm. Ed? A bunch of other people came in and to, to help uh, flesh out the mythology of like, you know, the Blair Witch and, you know, all the, you know, kind of the, the, the facts, like the history of the, of the, you know, of the myth. But, uh, but no, we, so Dan and I kind of took a lot of different things from a lot of different um, things that, that kind of like creeped us out as kids. But really, I think the biggest thing would be probably you know, just this, just the kind of the Salem witch trials, you know, the idea of like, um, you know, a, a woman who was unjustly basically murdered because of witchcraft, you know, this ridiculous thing. Um, but something. Hmm. Ted? Three camps. <laughs> hey, if we die, someone definitely has found footage, right? Yeah, right. 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 Yes. Yes. yeah. <laughs> so this is the way. Do you actually know where to go, Colin? Not at all. All right. Nice. That's great. There's nothing wrong with going in the woods at night. No, not at all. Nothing. Nothing bad could possibly come of that. Never. Never. This is the safest place to be right now. Exactly. Honestly.
Yeah. Very foggy night. I don't I don't know if the camera can see that. I don't know. Nah, this just has to be like a like a random staff building. Maybe. Nah, you're right, it's not someone's house, but I don't know what's good. There's cameras on it. Huh. Definitely kinda creepy. Yep. Maybe it's abandoned. Alright, I do like abandoned. I think I'm more worried about like a person being here than ghosts. Well, yeah, because didn't didn't you guys say that there's like accounts or cases of satanic worship yeah. going on out here? Well, that's what the, that's that used to happen for sure because I read about it okay. online. Well, that's good to know. That's very comforting. <laughs> yeah. Also, three murders. Three happened. Three. That is the biggest toad. Dude, he's just vibing. Yep. He's not scared of no one. Nah, he didn't even care that we were walking. Yo, he doesn't care. <laughs> you think he's like, oh! oh! So, what we're trying to do is find this abandoned church, but you don't know where it is. I have no idea, I've never been here. But and how do you know, what, online, it said to just go straight? Yeah, so apparently we take this path for like a mile. A mile. And then it's to the right. Okay. Right off the path. Okay, so hopefully, yeah. Uh, so. Well, we probably went like half a mile so far or less, so. Yeah. What was that? You heard that? Too? Hear that? There's footsteps. Yeah, I heard that. There's like footsteps up there, but it probably isn't most likely an animal. On the sign, there's a cross that someone did in black. So. Just to give you guys an idea, we've been walking now for about 20 minutes. And just saying, this is how far back this church actually is. This is a hike. Also, just letting you guys know, I have no service. Just pointing that out. We're coming up to a light right now. It could be a house, I don't know, a building, maybe a town. You can kind of see it in the woods. Right in here. You see that building? Oh, so we have a river on this side. Looks like someone dug a grave, bro. Yo, that That's is it. fucking eerie. Oh my god. Dude, we gotta go in there. I think there's a path, dude. Dang. Look at this church. This is crazy, dude. Yeah. Yep. A lot of spiders. Okay. Dang. It's in ruins, huh? That's like everything else here for the Blair Witch Forest. That's it. We could find out. We can do an investigation here, though. Drop our stuff. Oh. That's kind of cool art. Oh, there's a big spider. I know, there's a lot of big ones here. Dang. That's not good. Should we start here? I'm down to start here. Regan. Yeah, me too. Let's pause for a sec. Yep. Well, we decided to set up now. Well, we're setting up. Uh, we're gonna take the uh, music box. It's gonna go by this doorway in case someone does wanna come through this way. Uh, we got cat balls, of course. REM pods, nothing out the ordinary except the witch box, which we're gonna bring up and we're gonna see if people or someone reacts to it. Footsteps over there? Yeah. I heard it, yeah, I heard that. Yeah, I heard it when I was talking, it was over there behind you. Yo, that's creepy because you were just talking about the divot. I know, I know. Damn. But we'll see, it could be anything. The only thing I'm worried about here is you can hear that. There's a whole river going on that's flowing super loud, but. Sometimes they do say that if you're near water or r rain, like they harvest that energy in some way. Don't know, but I had some crazy things happen when it rained when we were doing ghost hunts, so we'll see. <sighs> Let's see. Yep, still, oh man, we haven't heard that sound in a while. Dude, that sound just gave me PTSD. <laughs> there is a big spider right there. All right, assuming this works, 
All right, still got it. Now my theory too is like, I feel like maybe the ghosts still see this place as a whole, as yeah. like a whole building. That's my guess. I don't really know though. Cause it could be two different realms or worlds. I don't really know about that. It would be very interesting if there's like actual residual activity going on out yeah. there. You know what I mean? Like maybe somebody walking through the door or like maybe this was the back of the church where the pastor would have his desk right here or something like right. that. Right, yeah. Never know. Like, we don't know. We'll, we'll see though. What happened oh. here after? Oh. Right, tell them what that sound is so they know in case I did Diabetes. Okay. I'm type 1 diabetic. My blood sugar's a little high because we went hiking and I want it to be high so I don't go low way out here in the middle of nowhere and die. Correct. Well, <laughs> so if you hear that beeping, if my editor decides to even keep some of that in, try not to, but if we need to for that point, now you know why you hear the beeping. Well, if you do die, at least it's gonna be on camera. <laughs> oh, that's true, bro. That's Worth. true, Colin. Worth guys, it. Thank you. Thank you. you. Like the video. Yeah, like and subscribe. Like it for me, man. Like yeah. it for my life. Yeah. Let's get some likes for Colin. Really yeah, right yeah. Uh, all right. Yeah. Guys, by the way, we also have the Alice box. Yep. Just saying. We, we picked that up when we were in the UK. We, do we turn it on right now? It's time to start. No. Psychic. Psychic. Psychic, the first word. Psychic so far, we're getting. Tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, for like Penhurst. Wait. Represent. Represent. Psychic, psychic and represent. represent. Well, psychics represent. Well, they don't represent, but they speak for the spirit world. Here, let's, let's introduce real quick. Okay. All right, everybody. I am calling out right now to any spirit that's in this forest. Maybe if you were a murder victim, if you're somebody that's been here for a long time, a member of an indigenous tribe, maybe you saw the filming of the movie The Blair Witch Project, I don't know. Or you're a spirit that's completely unrelated. We're calling out to you because we want to know who you are and we want to know your story. But just to introduce myself, I'm Colin, here with... So I introduce myself? Yeah. My name is Josh, um, again, with what Colin said. We're here just to kind of learn about your story, who you are. Do you know that you're dead? Are you trapped here? Anything like that. And we have a bunch of devices and things left around us that you'll be able to speak and talk to us through them. And I'm Seth. If there's any spirits out here, would love to communicate with you, learn your story, know what you have to say. Don't be afraid of us, don't be afraid of our equipment. There's nothing here that's gonna harm you. We're here only because we're curious. So please, if you're here, come forward. And yeah, we come in peace. We only bring good energy and good vibes. So if you wanna talk, we're here to listen. We have open ears and we genuinely want to hear your story. So, yeah, come talk to us. Don't be afraid. All right. Should we maybe soon, not yet, we'll introduce the witch's box. Yeah. Not yet. We'll see what that we can baseline, conjure. Maybe? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is there somebody here anywhere in the forest? Can you walk towards my voice? If there's anybody here in this church or in this forest, can you please give us a sign? Can you make one of our devices go off? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Appetite. 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 All right. Hungry? This could have been a church area where they ate. Maybe, you know. No. That's true. Let's ask. Is there something you want to eat? If so, can you walk through this door or touch the red blinking lights that I'm pointing at with the antenna? Are you hungry? De cast. Decompose and it says cast. Hmm. Cast. Like an arm cast? movie? Yo, could be. We're witch. We're here doing the movie. Are you talking about the movie? Did you see some of the cast members? Is this forest haunted? Is 
Made. 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 Like M-A-D-E? Yeah, M-A-D. M-A-I-D. Oh, okay. So Made. I don't think a church would have had a maid, but... Nah, me either. Baby. 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 Made, baby. Is there... Did a baby die here? Oh, oh, oh! Got that! Oh my green, god! Green spike right there. Cave. Cave? Dude. And the green- I heard it, I heard it. That thing has been completely yep. silent this I whole time. I know. This definitely caught it because I went like that, so they're gonna have to zoom in, but we got that. Oh my so the god. a baby- Wait. Card. Card and Albert. Was the baby's name Albert? It said- it says Albert and it says Card. And we knew a baby died because that just went off. Dude, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm freaked out that the REM pod even went off because, I, like I said, guys, I just don't think anything is going to go off out here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's that's already a huge jump in the right direction. Well, that was bizarre because it was like somebody just walked in. Yeah, yeah. You know? It was so quick. Super <laughs> Done. Did you just... It, it got fucking cold, bro. That's right. Dude, there's... I'm like, not even there's like a, there's like a draft right here, right? Yeah. Yep. Now there is. Now there is. Yeah. And we've we've all been sweating this yes. whole time, bro. Yes. I know. And now all of a sudden we're all cold. But the Alice box. Name. name. I see Sally and name. Sally. Sally. And you were at Sally. Wait, Look. That's the video that I just posted this week. Yeah. Sally. Dude. No. Way. Yeah. It Sally says it. The name it says it. Sally. Sally. Okay. That's freaking Yo, creepy. That's fucking freaky, man. Do you know Dude. who this is? Yeah. If you do, can you say his name? Dude, I full on have goosebumps, dude. Like, hair on end. I can see it. <laughs> like, you can see my shit sticking straight up, bro. Holy you can crap. see my goosebumps. It's so hot, you can't get goosebumps. Yeah, I think we're starting to get the energy in here. If someone's really here, can you give us another sign? Can you set off another device like you just did? Scene? Scene. 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 Like and a scene in a movie? Whoa, I heard shuffling in there. Me too. Me too. And it just said scene, and you just asked. It's going again. Hunting. Hunting. No. Oh. Oh. In Yo. Woods? Oh. We just heard some noises over there? Dude, this is no Whoa, joke. that bug is huge. <laughs> Dude, no. Oh, God, you knocked it towards me. Jesus. <laughs> oh, I that was a firefly. Oh. oh. I love how like stuff is literally happening to us, but we can joke around. This is how you know we've been doing this for way too long. Yeah, like we're yeah. not like scared at all. We're a little too decent to yeah. Jaded man, jaded. Yeah, true. Yeah. <laughs> Are is, you no, hunting us? I think it sees us. It's like yeah. it's hunting. Yeah, it's yeah, you exactly. See what you us? said. Wanna hunt? Yeah. Do you see us? Can you come unless it can't come in here it's because it's a church. So it can only be oh. on the outside. Oh, oh, what? They're like just fucking, dude, that no, just yes. fucking, that just spiked all the way to the top, dude. And you really? Yes. No, you I didn't see I, I just yes. jumped. You scared me. You got so that, that must have caught yeah, it. So now, oh, this is going to say something, I think. Is it? Maybe not. Okay, so dude, it's friendly brought the church. Oh, 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 there you go. There you fucking go, man. What? The fucking REM pod again. Right as there. As soon as oh, we. my God. Fact is. Factors. So is, is he talking about the church and the factors that play in what we just said? I don't know. Mm. The church plays a factor in why he can't come Yeah, because dude, that spike, right. we brought it up, we bring up church, that went off, a dead a baby died here, and Albert was the name, apparently, if we're going by the Alice box. Mm -hmm. The Alice box is, is usually never wrong for us so far. Are you an evil spirit? Is that why you can't come into this consecrated ground? You know, I want to ask something too. Go ahead. If you're able to come through here, please do. Come join us. Welcome us. Imagine the music box goes off. Oh my I god. My oh my god, I want the music box to go off. If you're out here, please make yourself known. Okay, I'm going to ask a question. If you're a demon or you can't enter the church, can you walk up towards our voices? I saw that you were playing with that light over there. 
Can you do that again? Walk towards the red light. Despair. Despair? Remove and despair, it says. Remove despair. The only thing I could talk about is maybe the witch box. Maybe. But we haven't really introduced it, though. No. Unless they're sensing it. That's it the only be. other thing. We could, should we talk about it? Or just not? Right? Allie. Allie. Huh. I'm going to give you just a little bit more time. Please, if you see any of the red lights, any light, it's like a light bulb, just approach it. And then we know that you're here and we can talk to you. Are you here? Do you want us to leave the church? Thermal. Thermal. Is it about these? Because red is thermal, in a way. Heat? Heat, thermal. It is fucking oh, hot. Thermal. Is it true that these woods are haunted? Whoa. Oh, got it, right there. Yep, got it. It blinked, like Air it was like- I didn't even see it, damn. Nothing never goes off, bro. Dude, honestly, that was crazy. That was like a flash of light. Really? Seriously, yeah. That Man, was crazy. So that's twice that thing's gone. Everything, off. every time we bring up the word haunted or something like that, it goes off. So, someone's here. Yeah. Did, was the baby who died here Albert? East. East, east. All right, let's go east. <laughs> I don't know where that would be. <laughs> Let's go east. It I said. You said west. Uh, it said east. I'm going east. Is that right here? I don't know. The sun's not out. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Do you want me right here? Is this east? Blue. What did it say? Below. 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 <laughs> Unless he's trying to give us a sign or something. Like he's so close. Faith! Faith? Yo, that's faith. crazy. Faith, faith in a church. East, faith. I mean, we're in a church, dude. I know, I know. Salvation. salvation. Salvation! That's crazy, too, because Reach that's. Salvation! Reach that's salvation! What it says. Yes! This reach spirit salvation the and, and got got saved. Reach they salvation. Got saved, man. Dude, that's so crazy. it's a good spirit here. Yes. This is somebody who passed on in the afterlife. Yes. And reached that's salvation. And reached heaven or salvation. Wow. That's crazy, dude. That's, that's wild. Makes I, perfect sense. That, and that's the kind of intelligent stuff that we love to hear on on Ghost Investigation. Oh yeah. You know? Like you can't deny that kind of stuff. Allow. Allow. You have to allow yourself to reach salvation. Hmm. Stop trying to convert me, please. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for talking about how you were saved. Maybe that was you that walked in here. Can you let us know one more time that you're here or we're going to move to another room? You can speak. You can touch one of these lights again. We've seen it happen. And just to point out, there are no power lines, no power grids, nothing. We're in the middle of the woods. Yeah. So, these things should not go off at all. We're going to leave now if you don't talk to us. Scream. Scream. 
Scream. I screamed right at the beginning of this. You did, too, but it wasn't on my camera, but should we all scream? Yeah. As Yeah? Let's do okay. it. What do we say? Just scream? Let's just scream, bro, like scared. Well, I mean, we are in the, dude, we are so far in the middle of the woods, no one's going to hear it. Let's just let's do just it. All. <sighs> all right, let's do that. You count, though. Okay. okay. Three, two, one. Is that going off? What? The oh, airway? yeah. Oh, never mind. I thought it was. Not bad. Save. 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 Oh, no. Weeps. Weeps? Weeps? Weeps. Like cry, like yeah. weeps. Jesus wept. It's starting to rain. Yeah. Fuck. Maybe we should, so now, I don't know if we're still getting stuff here or not, we can try moving our stuff to that room. Yeah. I see. That's a whole nother side. I keep feeling like I'm, like I want to go in there. Yeah, dude, yeah. no, me too. I, me too. Yeah. We can just pick up our stuff and move it. I still think in the church. we go to that room, we open the witch's box. Yeah. Let's see what that does to this place. Okay. Wait. Alphabet. Alphabet and surprise. 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 <laughs> unless, unless they're ready for the the witch box that we're about to bring in the next room. I hope not. Alright. Vile. Vile. Oh, they vile didn't... surprise, bro. Vile surprise. I think Look at it, that, man. If vile surprise, they're talking about how we shouldn't open that. If we open that, we're going to get a vile surprise, like something bad. Alright. That's what it sounds like. So let's go open it. Yeah, that means we have to open <laughs> it now. See, that's a bit freaky right there. The we are watching. Not enjoying that. So what I did is I put the music box here at the entrance of the church itself with uh, two cat balls on the bottom. We're still setting up, putting some stuff everywhere. But this is the last area of our church. Assuming that at one point you would walk into the church this is where you would sit, you would have your seats, and the, the priest would be right here doing his ceremony. No way. Whoa! The only thing I will say, not to debunk, but I'm gonna debunk. I think it could be the tripod. They're moving. Yeah, look, look, see, it can't be. Whoa. Dang, it's so hard to say, I don't know. Hold on, wait, let it sit for a second. I mean, nothing's moving over there. It shouldn't be going off. If you're, if that's you, could... I was just about to ask if you could step away. <laughs> it's hard. I don't know. Yeah. I, oh, there I, goes. There goes. Oh. Uh, Yo. I don't know, fuck, dude. Something fucking came in here, bro. Something that... could be in here right now. Yes. I don't. I'm so confused. Yeah. It could be something okay, for if real. If that was the tripod, it would be going off the whole the time. whole time. Yeah. Well, hang on. I'm gonna move it just in case. Whoa, yeah, yeah. Kappa, Kappa. No way. Oh, there we go, there we go. Whoa. Oh my god. Okay, something's here then. You, I, now I believe you. Now in. I believe it. And that car dude. alarm that just started going off, dude. Yeah, and it's still going off. Look, that leg in the music box, it's still going off. If that's you, please, can you step away? Dude. Can you just enter here? I think it can't come in, bro. It's always at the entrances, bro. I know. The outside. The front fucking door to the church. So they're like watching us through the window. They the can't door. come yes. in here. So they they can't be good spirits then. That's a assuming, bad sign, yeah. man. It wants us to open that box, I think. I forgot about the box already. I'm scared now. Should, should we even open that box? Yeah, I don't know. You think we should? Yes. All right. It's just creeping in the corners here, bro. It can't come. Can you please step away from the box, just so I can ask you a question? I don't know. I want to wait for it to go, like, off. If you cannot end... I'm gonna try that again. If you cannot enter this church, set... 
<laughs> Yo. Dude, uh-huh. this is typical demonic behavior, man. It's trying to piss you off. Every time Seth was just saying something, this thing interrupted him. Yeah. So what, what are we doing? The thing. I just moved this device, so it just texts straight ahead now. Yeah, yeah. Like, honestly, I didn't, again, I didn't expect anything to go off here. So I'm kind of freaked out. <laughs> yeah, like, we've hit a lot. We had a good good amount. For just in the middle of yeah. the woods, man. What, what were you going to pull out? Colin, you have, you want to try an app? Oh yeah, Spirit Talker, let's do that. And I've had some really, really crazy experiences with the Spirit Talker, so I'm confident this thing is going to, it's going to do something for us, man. I know it. Yeah? Yeah. Well, this will be the first time on Beyond the Dark we even use, I think, a cell phone as yeah. a... As in our tools legit yeah app. so that's cool man hey that's why we collaborate too see what other people use and what they try oh dude, i was just about to talk about that man. Dude, I, oh my god i didn't even oh man i wasn't even recording shut that, that off step away from the wall Oh, yeah, boys. Immediately, That's man. nice. Guys, That's I, nice. I was just about to say that we're adding the flashlight to the... Yo! Yeah. Right when you said flashlight oh God, again. dude. All right, so what can we talk? What can we say? I guess we can ask yes or no questions. Yeah, yeah ask if, they're, if they can come here. Are you not allowed in this building? Light the flashlight if you can't come in. Oh, oh okay. Oh. Well, that confirms that. Yeah, dude. That confirms it. Can you it. turn the flashlight off for us so we can ask you another question? Yep. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> this is a good response. Can you not enter the church because you're... Yep. I was going to ask you... Doesn't even matter. Because it's an evil spirit. Well, even if they're evil, I don't think they're going to say they are. Yo, right, though? When I got are you over 30 years old? Yes. It said 30 on the Alice box. Yes, oh, snap, it did. it did. I forgot. Dude, these responses are Yo, literally real time. Are you a man? Yeah. Wow. This is incredible. Yeah, this is actually some of the best, like, responses I got. Is, <laughs> like, real man. time. All right, turn that off again. Are you a demon? It's not a demon. I mm. really, really hope that, that that wasn't that's, a yes. That was a pause before that. I'm not sure. Yeah. That's a hard one. One more time. Light that up if you would consider yourself to be a demon. Hmm. <laughs> Same pause, too. Same pause and duration to light up again. I don't fuck with whatever this thing is, if you're gonna be honest. Yeah. Nah, it's a totally different change in the way I felt from that room versus where we are right now. Yeah, but remember, even over there, they couldn't come in. So it's been the same ghost lurking mm-hmm. here. Yep. Are you the same person that we've been talking to this whole time? <sighs> wow. Makes sense, though. It is, man. That makes so much sense, though. They're just peeking through yeah. the windows, bro. Yeah, lurking. Can you turn that off for us? Don't even. Oh. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Um. Do you want to hurt us? <sighs> huh. I'm staying here tonight, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Got your sleeping bag? I'm not even leaving it's this weird. room. It wants to communicate with us, but it apparently wants to hurt us at the same time. That's odd. Wait, did we ask to communicate to it, though? I mean, it is. It's answering our questions. Maybe it's trying to scare us, dude. 100%. That's what it's doing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Damn. It's trying to scare us. This is, this is an intelligent spirit. That's amazing. Okay, can you turn that off again, please? Boom. I, I, like, I'm blown away right now. I didn't think anything was going to go off, and now we're getting flashlights on top of REM pod, cat ball, music <laughs> box, like... Yeah. Every, every device is going off. I mean, this is the Blair Witch Forest. Can you set off another one of our devices so that we actually know this is you that we're talking to? It doesn't matter which one, just any device. Except that flashlight. Turn something else... Whoa, did you just hear that? What? I just heard a whole tree branch snap. 
I ain't hear it. I ain't hear it. But I sometimes hear weird stuff too that y'all don't hear. Yeah. Okay. I think it's time to open this box. If you want us to open this Divic box, please turn that flashlight on. Oh, 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 my, oh. God. oh my god. It knows there's something in that thing. Now I don't want to do it because now yeah, it wants to harm us when we leave. Either. Well, dude, Colin, do you have it? I don't even like know. Do you have any experience with this? I've never even seen a Divic box, so. Yeah. Um, I mean, I've seen a few, but I've never really opened one myself. Well, I debunked Divic boxes a few years ago through a discussion with my professor, but this box is different because it's somewhat of a Divic box, but it's not really a full on Divic box. Okay. This was just advertised as a haunted box. All right. So, so there's probably a haunted object then. It's not something in there. Yeah. Right. But you don't know what it is. I have no idea. Well, it wants us to open it. It keeps lighting up the flashlight as we're talking it about really it. Really like turning it on and off. To open it. I mean, I feel like this is already a bad idea. Like we yeah. definitely the should not be doing this. The only thing that makes me feel okay is that we're in the church. But then I feel like, what if we leave the church? That's the problem. What if we hey. leave the church? After this, do we have sage? Do you have sage, Colin, or anything? At your house uh -huh. or no? Uh-uh. Dang. We can go buy some, though. This I might not be at, a good idea. At like 2 in the morning? <laughs> I don't know. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. But it might be too late. Uh, it could be. I got a, such a weird vibe about this place. It's, yeah. It, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know about this. Like, well, Completely honestly. The only thing I would say about it is like, Colin's gonna open it, so we just stay back and that's all we do. Cause technically we're not opening it. That's the only thing that's making me feel yeah, positive. Fuck me, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> fuck yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck, bro. You're Thanks. Thanks, you yeah. guys. As soon as this goes off again, I'll ask. Okay. Are you the same spirit that was just lighting up our music box? Wow. Yes. Wow, dude. This is all flowing, all making sense. Even in that whole room with other devices, everything is making sense here. Bro, I don't know how to open this thing. Maybe it's You a can't sign even that... open up the box? No. Dude, maybe that's a sign that we shouldn't be opening this. Yeah, we don't have to. We could smash it against Wait, something. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, what is that? Something came out. Yo, I think this is ash, bro. What the... Yo, there's will someone sand. grab this? Dude, um, there's it's I think it might actually be yeah, ash it's... like you said. I feel oh, this feels weird to even touch, dude. It smells weird. What is it? What's in there, dude? These these two were in there. Marbles? Marbles. Is that a candle? That's a candle. Oh. Oh, a vial. Oh. oh my god, it's it's like the dibbit box said veil or vial, the same thing. That's what that oh, is. I just what? turned on right when you said that too. Wait a second. I think it's talking about what was inside before we even knew. That's Maybe. crazy, man. Yeah. yeah. Like yes. Potion? Look at I don't know. That's like witch related. Hell, it, Isn't that odd? It is, dude. That's really freaky. Uh -huh. So there's some other things too if you look in the back. It's why are they? Oh, what? cat ball, cat ball! Whoa. Right when we open it up, Fuck. first time, dude. It's getting closer with the flashlight. Too, I know. Man. That's crazy. Both devices off at the same time. As soon as we open the box. Now, dude, I I'm serious. This looks like some kind of ritualistic Yo, stuff. Yo, bro, hair. <gasps> what the fuck? Yo. Cat ball. Right when I pulled that out. No way. That's hair. Like a wig. Like, is it a wig or is it like actual human like hair? Like hair. I don't know. Again, guys, we don't know because we don't know what's in here. Yeah, so, we like, do. I'm gonna put this down. I just don't wanna touch that box at all. Mm hmm Yeah, man. Can I feel it, actually? I just said I didn't wanna touch it, but I just need a... I, can, I don't think... I don't know. I don't know if this is actual human hair, but... It's still here that someone could have used yeah, either or wore, way. like a wig, you know what I mean? It's very... Either way, um, it's very realistic human Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yo, huh. cat Fucking ball. cat ball's been going off non-stop since we opened it, dude. I know. 
Dude, someone's right here. I know. Is this your hair? <laughs> That's kind of creepy. I hope it's not. That's the stuff that was in that box is stuff that I would expect to see a witch use, like right. a, a vial, one, th that little crystal ball type thing. Like huh. that's just really weird that we yeah. that stuff right. in the Blair Witch Woods. Very witchy, man. We have to take that with us to the next spot after this as well. It, and the here, maybe. Yeah, if any of you guys know what that ball or any of that yeah. stuff actually is, please let us know. Because again, we have no freaking clue. I'm gonna like, unseal this. I don't know what was trapped in here. Obviously something was sealed in here. Do you break it, or as I have to do? Might have to, oh. It's out now. I'm creeped out right now. Man. I know, I know. I, we, we, none of us talked, and we're just like freaking out ourselves. Okay, for anybody that's out here, if you're the thing that likes to sit at the edge of this church, we have a device, a tool, What's that? Already started. Energy's here. What does that noise mean? Just it's detecting EMF. Oh, that so that's like a K2? Yeah. That noise right there? Yeah. Okay. Whoa. We want to talk to okay. you, and if you use your voice, we'll be able to hear what you're saying. What are you? Whoa. Right when I turned it on, dude. Right when I dude. hit the start, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. And that hasn't gone off since we I opened know. the box. I know. I know. Okay, yeah, you can come back towards us because we want to talk. What are you? Are you a human? I'll start again. Yeah. Phone, bro. Hey. Oh my Immediately, god. Immediately, man. The, first the phone. First, first word is phone. And you're on the phone. Yes. Yeah, that's that's what we're going to talk to you through is this phone. Thank you. Here, look. If you can't come in here, I'm going to hold the phone like you're asking out here. Who or what are you? Can you tell us? Is the spirit that we were talking to earlier still here with us? Do you want us to leave the church? Oh, what? Right fucking next to me. Oh, fucking scared the fuck out of oh me. My God. I'm so on alert. Yo. Evidence. Evidence! Evidence, evidence bro, yes! Evidence. Fuck. As soon as the cat ball goes off, it says evidence. Yes, we're, we're using that as evidence to know that you're real. Yo, I'm, I see like a blinking light over there. Do you actually? It was like blue and it was on the ground. But it could be nothing. But I'm not sure what that means. Okay. Who haunts this building? Can you tell us that? Who is here talking to us? Do you not have enough energy to use this device? Wind. Wind? Are you an elemental spirit? Bro. You heard that? That sounded like that a was a whole tap on their tree. Yeah, right there. Crazy the flashlight stopped going off too. I know. Dude, yeah, I didn't even notice that. It hasn't it like gone moved, off since it, we opened the Dybbuk box. Exactly, no, it, yeah, it moved from it. Oh, right what? there though, right there, sorry. Fuck, man. Right when you guys turn As we've been looking at it the entire time, mm -hmm. it wants our attention here so freaking bad. Bro, bring it back over there again. Who are you? Terrified. Holy fuck. We just... We, said, you said you're on edge, bro. We just said we were scared. It's <laughs> called, dude. It's been, dude. That is an evil spirit. It's just mocking us and and all this stuff. Oh, dude, it said hunting. I know. In the Alice box. I know. Are you hunting us? Funny how this thing stops going off when we come over. Oh my, what? God! Oh my God! What the fuck, man? Literally mid sentence talking about it. That's insane. Pointing at it too, man. Pointing at it, dude. We're just wondering, are you an evil spirit? Are you trying to scare us? Heart. 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 Heart? I mean, my heart was beating right there. Yeah. It's been pounding. I straight up just heard somebody talking. What'd they say, though? 
I did. Left. Left. And I heard it to the left. Yes. Oh my god. I heard Fuck. somebody whispering in this direction right here. I swear to God. You're over here? You know what justifies you saying that is you heard it and then it said left. Mm -hmm. So it's not, you know what I mean? What's the coincidence of that? Right, exactly. That's what I'm saying. It's these, this is the evidence that can prove ghosts are real and this is actually all happening. Dude, I haven't been this on edge in a really long time. We like, haven't done, we haven't done videos like this in a while either though, too. This place is spooky, Whoa, man. Twig, just like a full on footstep. I heard, I heard that. In the church though. Are you coming into the church? Hell! Hell! Oh my god, I just got chills through my whole goddamn Hell, body, man. Who's coming Fuck. into the church? You coming into the church? Hell. Oh my god. We should probably stop now. Yo, yeah, bro, think... what are the odds? In a church. I know. Hell. I've I never know. gotten that word before, we ever. We got reached salvation and in hell. hell in the same session. Dude, Yo, I got fucking this is getting actually man, too once again. bad. I have chills all down my back right now. I can't even sleep now, bro. Now yes, I don't even want. Saying. I don't even want to do this anymore. Now Dude. I'm like, all right, we we got it. Like we we proved ourselves. This happened you know is I mean? crazy, and we still have one more place to go to. Yeah, I know. So are you saying that you are from hell, or you want us to go to hell? Can you tell us what you meant? Insight. 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 It knows something about hell. It has insight so about it must hell. Be from. It's from hell. That, it's here to mean, share it with yeah. us, man. That might be actually true, yeah. Damn. Or it's a priest and they're pissed that we're trying to talk to the dead like it's a sin. True. And they want us to go to hell and they want to give us insight. I'm saying worried like, about us going to hell. Right. If a priest saw what we were doing right now, they'd be pissed. They'd be pissed. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you, are you religious? Do you believe in God? Wow. What? Wow. All right, that means it. it's pretty much saying like, wow, why would you say that? Like, it's probably a demon. <laughs> In the end. Yeah, like, wow, why would you ask man. that? I feel really sick right now. Emma. Emma? Do you know Emma? Uh, no. You know Emma? I do not feel like Emma. I'm either. No. Do you want to... We could just... Track, take a break? Yeah, I'm like nauseous as fuck. And this isn't even for cameras or anything. Yeah. Like, okay. I actually feel like. Yeah, no, if you're if you're feeling weird, we should stop. Cause this Randomly, is, this man, is like pretty odd. right after we opened that, and I didn't even think that was going to do anything. I know, I yeah. I feel terrible inside, actually. I think what I, I would like to do. Water, man. Yeah, I know. I mean, this is the area that at the point where I would always stop my investigations and I would go to a new spot. I always stop after it gets this crazy. Yeah, maybe we should. Always. Maybe we should move on. I'm it's ready. not. Victor? Victor? Yeah. Hmm. I'm ready to call it, man. All I right. don't feel fucking good. We have, like, such a long walk. I mean. <laughs> should I just ask something? Sure. Is Victor for me? Yes or no? Figured I'd at least ask. Although Emma came up, so that could be nothing. But I do know a Victor. I mean. I, I know an Emma, but she's not living. What? Fuck. Oh my fucking god. Holy shit. Frightening. Frightening. And it just said frightening on the thing, and he's actually fucking thrown up. I think we need to stop and get the fuck out. Yeah, we need to stop. Are you okay? No, man. All right, let's stop. Yeah, let's stop. Whatever spirits are out here, you can't follow us. Yeah, no one's following You're us. Leave us to. alone. <laughs> we were trying to talk to someone that wasn't you. I'm shutting all. I'm shutting all this off. I'm shutting all this off. I'm just shutting everything off. Like I don't want to. Drain. Drain. It just said drain and terrified. And now it's draining his energy. It's just said drain. I just heard it say drain. Yeah. We're gonna grab your stuff, all right? Man. All right. I just got 
really Bro. like legitimately sick. No, I know. I can tell. You're throwing up. We're, we're gonna get out of here, all right? Everything's it said it was draining your energy yeah, through the thing, fun, bro. Man. Everything's gonna be fine. Memories fun. here. Oh my god, dude. I don't even like this fucking place, dude. Yo, like, no bullshit. This is not fucking a joke right now. This is not a joke. You think you just make himself throw up like that? This is honestly fucking scary. Wow, bro. Something just straight up entered my body in two seconds' time. Well, whoever, whatever you are, you're clearly not a good spirit, so I'm not going to talk to you good either. Stay the fuck away from calling. I, I don't even know what you want to say. The only thing to do in this situation is to always stop everything. Always turn off all your batteries on everything. So the demon or ghost or whatever, I don't really know the realm of demons or if they're real, but there's evil ghosts, there's evil spirits, and turn all the equipment off so it doesn't get its batteries or because it'll, it'll leech on you and charge on you. So turn everything off and just fucking, I don't know, goddamn pray. The fuck? Me either. Like we had scratches on our back, well my back on the UK, but I never seen someone throw up like hard ever, and it was instant, instant. Huh? I know. I mean, dude, you good now? Yeah. Are you all right? I gotta sit down. Yeah. Man. Take it. Dude, you're sweating hard. Whatever it I know, is. I got really fucking. No, I'm good, man. I mean, I move. I shut everything. Well, we shut all the device off. Sorry, shit. It's all good, man. Don't worry. Dude, when you did the first like, Ugh, I was like, what the hell is going yeah, on? It was so like, fast. Dry heaving, bro. I was like, what the fuck? I've never, I've never seen anyone throw up. I've never fucking seen anything like that. Before. Never, 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 bro. Has this ever happened to you before? Once. How long ago? Two years. Where were you? Another fucking haunted park. <laughs> In South Dakota. It's in Iowa, actually. This, though, I will say, is really different, man. Because I was sitting there and I didn't feel bad at all. And then all of a sudden, I just started to feel a pain. And, like, I'm shaking now. And then... <clears throat> Alex talks. Yeah. Then all of a sudden... I turned it off. You did? Alex Box has been turned off this whole time. It's Unless they me. turned it on. At this point, I'll believe in anything. This, uh, it just came on, like. The fuck? It's trying to fucking get our attention, bro. Hang on. <laughs> I had the Alex Box turned off. Is it in my bag? It says tell and fist. Yo. It turned on by itself, but the words are tell and fist. So I don't know what that means. I'm just letting you all know. <laughs> it, it, you swear you turned that off. I turned it off before we entered to the new room because he was using his a new box. His new box. So I didn't need this one anymore. It just turned on. Tell and fist, tell. Tell what? It wants to say something? It only turn Large. 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 Tell fist in large. Is something large here? Something... I don't know. Something's going on. It's going again. Act. Act. <clears throat> tell fist large act. I feel like they're angry. And dude, it turned on again by itself. I'm turning it off after this last message. Key and think. Think. I'm turning this thing off. Okay. What's in that? Just some other stuff. Okay.
Here, bro, I got more. <clears throat> this is yours as well. Thanks, man. Just to see if someone actually is here. Okay. Ignore that. It's a dead spider. Okay. I'm just seeing if it senses someone waiting for us by the door. Might be okay. Assuming there would be someone right here. We don't want to communicate with you. We don't want your presence. If you came with the Dybbuk box, we're leaving it here. We don't normally do stuff like that. And we're never gonna do something like this again. So stay here. Don't follow us. And leave leave Colin alone, leave all of us alone. Do not follow us. You're not allowed. I want to point out, I think this is the worst I've ever felt on a ghost hunt. Like ever? Ever. And this is not even a famous haunted place, but... I mean, you look like shit, bro. I know I do. I feel For like real. fucking shit, man. Like... Yeah. There's something, it's like in my head, too. Like, I get, I'm like pissed off right now, and I feel fucking horrible. And it's just, it's not good, man. I don't know how to articulate that. Get back to the car Let's just do that. What yeah. What is that? Goddamn pentagram. Wow. Right outside the fucking window, bro. And dude, you want to know some weird ass shit, but that's actually where we're hearing the taps. That's what I'm saying. This is the area where we opened the box and I got real sick, too. I know. I just can't, I, I've never seen anything like that before. Well, it's it's what's gonna be crazy on film. Anybody, both of you guys got this on the footage. <clears throat> it was a contiguous shot when I started throwing up. It's not like I went over into the shadows and well, fucking flicked my uvula or something, you know? Well, dude, on, honestly, bro, because I was going through like all these ideas, like how could you have made yourself throw up? And I was thinking like. Nah, bro. Like we were watching him. The we were watching time. him the whole fucking time, and all of a sudden, you just—it just happened out of nowhere. I and I was me, like, dude. dude, I believe in it because I'm always skeptical, like on other me people, too. and I just meet them. And like, bro, when it happened to you, I was like, shit, no, I actually believe it. I mean, bro, you threw up a lot. I know. It like, I don't. Happening, man. Now I have to have. I don't know. I don't even know. Like, I've seen rumors. Or like, I heard not. I heard stories where people throw up. No, actually, no. I was with Elton and he threw up and he was sick knocked the entire fucking day. So you're the second person I seen throw up. And we were talking about that today too. Yeah, we were making jokes about it. I mean, we always do. Well, I always say, I always make jokes. I'm like, yo, Seth, throw up or yeah, something. You know yeah. what I mean? But like, I, I yeah. don't know. I never really expected no. that to happen. Like, I, I like to make jokes because like, it is real. But like, I like to just make jokes on it. I don't know why. But maybe it's to like, ease the tension. You make jokes on something.